Surveillance video at ITC repairs on Burleigh captures the creak of a back door, giving this man in a purple hooded sweatshirt access to owner Paolo Torres' inventory Saturday. My wife was pretty shocked. She was the one that came in the building and she was just a nerve wreck. She was crying and it's frustrating and you don't feel safe. <laughs> Another camera captures the getaway through the broken glass door Torres says the man smashed on his way in. Torres says he took hundreds of dollars in cash and tech equipment. Oh, it's Christmas time. It's uh, now I have to get doors. I have to get surveillance. I have to get more equipment. I need to think about securing my building because it's um, I can't really take a vacation without, you know, being concerned about what if somebody breaks in again. Thursday, Milwaukee police shared these photos that show a man in what looks to be the same purple sweatshirt. Police asking the public for help finding the man. <laughs> Meanwhile, across the street, Collector's Edge Comics also hit. The police told us that they had uh, several break-ins and asked if we had video and we did. Owner Steve Dobrzynski showed 12 News that surveillance video. A man in a purple sweatshirt kicks through the glass front door. It's, it's not so much the what they take because that's, you know, if you get a couple of bucks in cash, big deal, but it's the amount of damage that you have to replace. Kendall Torres mentioned it being Christmas time. Both of those small businesses lost hundreds of dollars this holiday season. Kristen, in repairs and cash, the owner here at ITC Repairs tells me they also took his sense of security. He's looking into adding even more security measures to keep his small business safe. All right, Kendall Keys reporting live in Milwaukee. Thank you.